welcome to the Mark West Sports Podcast. Kendrick Nunn and a draft pick for DeMar DeRozan, I'll take it. I'll take it. Mm-mm. I'll sign DeMar DeRozan uh, to... What are you saying? To a two, to a, to maybe a two-year deal. Um, so tell me the, I wouldn't see why so not. So you the hood no more three year t- than... Three-year team than, option. Than the professionals? If the hood knew more, they'd be making more money. No. Oh, the hood is on fleet right now. <laughs> Trust that. You feel me? You already they be know making it's more money. Of, the hood got bread. Trust when it that. comes to that. The sweat is real. Yeah, because, again, the, you know, let me, let me, they let good me, on let fraud let me, and all me, of that. Let me go ahead and, 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 and tell you. I'm looking at this list right now. You got Anthony Davis. Anthony, Anthony Davis. Um, You have Brandon Ingram. You have DeMar DeRozan. Garbage ass. You got Fred Van Liet, Fleet, garbage ass. You got Montreal Harrell, Gordon Hayward. You got um. So pretty much Buck everybody Dombich. on the list is garbage. You got to Gorn West. <laughs> yeah, you got Gordon Dragic. Of course, you got the Dragon. Fred you Van got, Fleet nah, 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 definitely nah, nah. You is Davis a player. Burdens, Yo, got, got Fred Ari- Van Fleet single handedly beat the Heat this season. Who cares? Do you remember about- that game? It was in the bubble. Single handedly, this dude like, beat no, us no, in that like, game. No, nobody cares about you one game. About that? You talking about regular season? Like, no. Hey, God, we're in one the finals game. right now. Come on. Exactly. If Come we down. had him in the Relax. finals right now, we would, would, would it if probably we had a, the dragon right now. That, like, what are you sweet. saying? Like, come on, man. If we but, had the dragon, what? Like, come on, man. The best down. ability is availability, no, though. He's not playing right now. No, no. Let me let me explain something to you. Dragon's just not playing right now. Right now, you got Goran Dragic number eight on the list. That's already gonna be a sign. Um, for the Heat, so I'm already taking him off the list because I know they're gonna sign him. It's loyalty over here. Something that it seems like you don't know about, and you're talking about you being a, a, a Miami native and it's a Heat culture and this, that, and the other. And you, like, none of the first person already off the list is going Dragas because they're not letting him go nowhere. Period. So there's nine more people on the list. You got Anthony Davis. Anthony Davis should be who the Heat go after. Why? Put him at the motherfucking power forward. His no, that's no, no, not no, no, realistic, no, 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 though. No, you how, it's not realistic. Look, look. See, this is the reason why the hood is talking, and you could go ahead and sit on the corner real quick for a few <laughs> more minutes while I go ahead and explain what I'm talking about. Because drug is already not off realistic, the list. Man. It don't need to be realistic. I'm looking at the list right now, and that's what I'm going on. I'm not going on. Oh, you know, uh, 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 you know, it's fantasy basketball or anything. That, I'm going that's, on, no. That's basically what you're doing. No, it's not. How is, how is it? you like, who do we got on? Because our- in fantasy basketball, yeah, I'll draft Anthony Davis. Who do we have? Look. But this dude is going to be loyal to LeBron. He's staying in L.A., bro. Exactly. See, but you're not letting <laughs> me explain what I'm supposed to be explaining. You're cutting in, and that's the whole reason why I'm saying Dragas is out the, off the list. You got nine more people on the, on the list. You got Anthony Davis, which is again freak of nature one in a lifetime on player i think he's better than bam why because he has the shot if bam has the shot or can um can uh, wind up getting better and more consistent at his shot then i don't need anthony davis but since he's on the list and he's number one on the list i'm gonna go ahead and say that he should try to go get anthony davis he's a free agent we don't have to trade nobody we're gonna go ahead and already sign Goran Dragic to a reasonable contract. People like um, that we have on the, on the Heat that's gonna go ahead and probably be gone and be assistants is Udonis Haslam. So that contract is gone. I don't know how much he make, but I'm pretty sure since he's loyal, they got him at probably like three or maybe four million dollars a year. You know. Then uh, Solomon Hill, we grabbed him on a trade. Okay, Team Wolf. You know, I fought with you the long way, but I don't fuck with you the long way because I don't know you. Every time I seen you in regular season, when the trade happened, you oh, always was Iguodala. doing some bullshit. Iguodala. Iguodala, you're going to sign him, but you're going to sign him to a veteran's contract, which is minimum. Don't you even need to worry about that. And he are, we already have him signed to two more years anyway. On two more or one more year. But again. Kelly O. Kelly O'Linick. We could get rid of Kelly O if we're getting fucking Anthony Davis. Like, why do I need Anthony Davis? And I got Kelly, uh, like, why would I keep Anthony, um, Kelly O'Linick and I got Anthony Davis? Like, calm down. That don't even make no sense. So the reason why I'm saying that is, again, we're going to keep Bam at the center. We're going to keep Bam at the center, even though we know Anthony Davis should be the center, but I know uh, um, Bam don't have a shot. What so about I'm John gonna, Wall? Is John Wall a garbage no, too? No, I don't fuck with John Wall. Again, availability means everything. You're always injured. Come yeah, on, that's man. what I'm saying. Like, availability is everything. Look, we, I'm on Availability is everything. I'm on the heat right now. I'm on but the you're heat talking right about Goran Dragic, who's Goran. not available again, right now. 
when so if we had a Fred Van loyalty. Fleet, are you not hearing if what we had I'm a saying? Fred Van Fleet hold on, hold on, hold on, right hold on, hold on, hold on. now. What does the Heat culture mean? Loyalty, giving everything in the no gas tank. No franchise that is, is absolutely a hundred percent loyal. Go ahead, huh? No franchise is a hundred percent loyal. How many I, players did we let go I hear that we you. even drafted that All we right. that grew up in our system? Right, Karan so why, Butler, we were loyal to Karan so Butler. So why? No. So why? Because he would. He, no, like because he mean, probably didn't buy into the motherfucking culture. Why you Don is still here then? Why is he here? Okay, that's like, what are that's you saying. What, like, that, come on, man. How many Loyalty players means something. have left the Heat? Like, just they don't even Wins, play his ass, Winslow, and they pay him. Gone. Mario Chalmers. Gone. Um, Richardson. Gone. Again, I mean, you know, again, it's a business. It's like, a business. But hell? again, all those people that you just said was not consistent. Were they consistent? Yes or no? Okay. So, no. So, so I'm that's like, what I'm saying about Kendrick Nunn. Kendrick Nunn was he is, consistent? Hell yeah, he was. No, he's not consistent. So how how, how he came number two in you know um, rookie? Where is he play, in these um, finals the when you need him? So how did he Where's come he number two? Where is he in these two? finals? You didn't just see Where the game that he finals, just had, bro. You didn't just see the game he just had, which he made had us win. He had a decent game. He had a decent game. I mean, but so, where were you in game two? Where were you in game three? Where you were you in game four? Where was everybody else? There it's was a, a lot of players stepping up. Eight. Like, look, look. Tyler see, Hero's been stepping like, up more than Kendrick You sound Nunn. like you're not from Dade County because, like, the shit that Why? you're saying because right I'm now, real? it don't make no <laughs> damn <laughs> sense. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. They loyal. They loyal, so they went ahead and keep him shooting. Duncan Robinson was giving bricks all day, like, but damn, they're keeping him in the game and they keep telling him far away them threes. Yeah. But That's part of our culture. Like, like, come on, man. He's a shooter. And what they tell shooters when they're a shooter. He went there, went Kendrick like so Ruff, Reggie Kendrick Miller didn't have off not, games. Kendrick Reggie Nunn, Miller didn't have off games. Kendrick Nunn like, is you not remember a shooter when Ray like Allen was here Robinson. and Ray Allen was missing for a minute? And we like, what the fuck? Like, damn, I'm so used to That's seeing this. That's a shooter. Exactly. And what is Kendrick Nunn is not a shooter. How he's not a shooter. He's not a shooter like a Duncan Robinson or Reggie Miller or Ray Allen. Come on, man. You're talking oh about from God. Dade County, but you know, you're making us look bad he's right now. He's a shooter. He, he's, he's not just a point guard. Not like a Duncan Robinson or Reggie Miller or Ray Allen. So where you, when he first you let those players shoot because you know they're gonna get hot eventually. They will get hot. That's why you tell players like that to shoot. But Kendrick Nunn is not a shooter like that. Maybe he could develop into one later know. in his career, but he's not know, that right now. You, I don't know what you were saying. But in the you know who season. is a shooter like that you is Fred Van Fleet. Oh, no, that no, no. dude is a shooter. No. And if you put him in no. this game right now. So you're saying Van Fleet is better than Kendrick Nunn? <laughs> Kendrick, um, yes, Van Fleet is All better right. than Kendrick Nunn. Now the world is going crazy. I see aliens now. But regardless <laughs> of the fact, we're going to go Why? ahead and change Why? the, sub the like, subject. Can, can, you want to pull up the stats? Yeah, we could pull up the stats. Chris gonna you, go ahead I mean, and you know, our producer gonna pull that Van shit Fleet. Mm -hmm. Come on, like in, in the game, I don't know how many points he had. Don't worry, they are gonna pull it up. Don't, I don't worry know about how many that. Points he had. My point gonna be made in a few more minutes. He was raining threes on us. It's gonna be made in a few minutes. Don't worry about that. You know, um, if we're on that win now mode, and we can get. We're not on win win um now mode. Well, we're what? two. two what are we're you talking about? We're about to win, like Pat, you said, and we're not on win now. Pat, mode? Pat Riley Come said. On, man. Pat Riley said that we're two years ahead of schedule. He was not thinking that. We, he was like, "Yeah, we're gonna be a better team," but he was not thinking that we're gonna be in the finals. Yeah, I mean, we're in I the finals, so that. of course it's win now mode. But we're ahead of schedule, so why derail the fucking schedule by fucking trading away our fucking core? That don't make no damn sense. It's coming from the fucking Godfather. We're what in the saying? NBA finals, bro. You don't get much close. Like, there's only one team that's closer to winning the finals than us right now. You know? They go to stats. Our loyal producer just went ahead Yo, and gave our stats. Now, here go the stats. Now, you got Kendrick Nor Nunn, a rookie. So, oh, wait, 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 no, 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 no. Here go points, my point. And here go my point. More points, more rebounds, no, more no. assists. What about minutes a game? Like, Dragic is the pure, like, come on, man. Points per game. You got Kendrick Nunn. 15.3 points a game, average. Then you got, and he's a rookie. And then you got Van Vliet that been in the Van league Vliet. a few years. Boom, 17.6 points. So you average two more points. It's, it's 20, he's actually only 26 years old, bro. He's actually only 26 years so, old. So, 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 Kendrick Nunn is, is old. 25. 
You got a 25 and a 26 year old. Regardless. One is better than the other. So, how? like I said, how? Fred Fleet is he a better more, player than Kendrick Nunn. Kendrick Nunn. Like, what do you mean? Kendrick Nunn's what do you coming mean? off the bench. The stats are right there. Kendrick Nunn is paying, uh, coming off the bench. What are you talking about? Dragic is get, getting a lot of, like, you, don't you know he's he's Dragic? He's Dragic's backup now. He's. But he gets and more he's minutes. made big shots. He gets more minutes. He's made big shots in the big moments. Oh Let, let's God. not. Let's not forget Calm down. he's also got he's also got a championship where he made big shots in big moments last year. Okay. So Van Fleet is a better player than Kendrick Nunn right now, and I would trade for him. Why not? And I just think he's just a better backup. They go fucking up the salary cap again. Because Dragic, this, Dragic's got, got an injury we, now. We, we don't got him. I love Dragic we got more him than off everybody, but he's we got, got an injury now. No, that is the reality. That's why you got Kendrick so, Nunn. Like he's a fucking pup. Like what are you saying? Like that's the whole point of fucking Heat culture. We build our players up. Like what are you talking about? You already are. Oh, let me go ahead and trade trade Kendrick Nunn. Like that don't even make no sense, but. Like, I'm not going to go nowhere with you, so I'm going to go ahead and change the subject to football right now. I'm going to go to the kind of UN versus Clemson tonight. You know, um, me, personally, we already know what Clemson does. You know, we called him Sunshine last week, and he definitely uh, did what he did.